ladies, welcome back to Poppins Approved. Today's review is gonna be all about the diaper bag from the brand Outback. So I recently found this company called Outback. They make really beautiful genuine leather bags But after like researching their company I found that they actually do make diaper bags as well So this is one of their diaper bags I think it's like their main first diaper bag that they created because this one comes in tons of different colors The color that I have here is green and Gosh, it's pretty. It's so good. You can see it says Outback right there on the front. The leather on this bag is so nice. It feels so like soft and smooth. You can see I've been using this um, for the past like couple weeks and it's gotten some like little scratches and marks and it just patinas really beautifully over time. You can see here it comes in tons of different colors. This is the green. It also comes in a wine color, which is like a really pretty reddish. It comes in a a tan, a brown, even like a navy color, which is so beautiful. And then um, right here, you actually have kind of a two-toned color option. So there is something for everyone. Also, did you see the price on this bag? It's $156 for a real genuine leather bag. Not only is it just like a beautiful genuine leather bag, it has some really cool features that I'm excited to show you. So on the front here, it does say Outback, which you saw. It is a flap closure and usually flaps bother me. But with this bag, I don't know if it's because I just like love how soft it is and like the way that it looks, but this flap does not bother me. It has two magnets and these are like legit magnets. They are strong. They find their home really easily. It's very satisfying to just sit here and play with these magnets because they are super nice and strong. And when you open up the bag, I love that there is a zippered section right here that I can easily get to things I need quickly like my wallet and keys and stuff like that. I also wanted to mention that these are YKK zippers. It's very nice and smooth. You can see that the hardware here is more of like an antiqued um, brass looking color. And I think it looks really, really nice with this green color. Um, this pocket is really nice and deep. I think it goes down to all the way about here. Let's see here. Um, I have my wallet in there. I also have um, a receipt. Costa Vida, you guys like Costa Vida? Super good. I have my large keys in there with my key ring that I got from Amazon. I'll link that below for you guys. And then also down in there, I do have these um, little stroller clips that come with your purchase. These are really nice because you do have um, two D rings on the sides of your bag that you can um, attach these to and put this onto a stroller or a grocery cart. Um, I think that's all I have in there, but yeah, the pocket goes to about, oh, it goes lower than I thought. It goes to about right here on the bag. So it's a nice um, deep pocket. You can fit lots in there. Let me just show you the sides really quick. Quickly. You do have two pockets on the sides and these are getting super soft with use in the side pockets I'm keeping my sunglasses and then also um, a hand sanitizer spray is in here as well now something else that the company does that's so cool is they will add initials or your name whatever you want onto part of your bag so in this one you can see right here it says Jennifer super super cute that it just like personalizes your bag for you and then on this side pocket I am keeping my cell phone now I'll show you in a second how bottles fit on the outside of these pockets as well you can see on the bottom there are feet so it does keep the base protected now on the back here, this is really cool. You have adjustable backpack straps, but it also can come out like this. So you can use this as a shoulder bag or a messenger bag. And then when you wanna use it as a backpack, you just pull those right back through. I love that I can grab this on one side though and if the whole thing's not gonna pull through. When I'm getting out of the car and stuff, I can just easily grab the backpack strap. For me, since I tend to wear my bags backpack style, I kind of wish that this was actually just like this as a backpack and then I could use this part as a grab handle. I think that would be cool because right now I'm just kind of grabbing the backpack straps when I'm getting out of the car or I'm just kind of grabbing the top of the bag or the side. So if there was some sort of grab handle handle on the bag, I would personally like that better. I also thought that these thin straps were gonna be really uncomfortable, but I have not found that to be the case. I think that where they are placed is really nice and I feel like it feels pretty good on my back. Um, I wouldn't say it's like padded and the most comfortable backpack I've ever worn, but it definitely doesn't bother me at all and I think it just looks really nice and simple. You can see there, there's the Outback logo again on the very back. Now let's move on to the interior. 
You can see that on the sides there are snaps here and these are nice and strong. I don't find that they're coming undone a lot unless I have the bag really packed full. Like I mentioned, YKK zippers, really, really nice and smooth. It does have a little tail here so you can really get into your bag nice and easily. Now let's take a look in here. This material is a nice um, wipeable material. I do wish that it was a lighter color. It is a dark color. I know some of their bags do have lighter colors. Just make sure to check out their website and look at all the pictures. They have really nice detailed pictures on their website so you can see exactly what you're getting. Right here, just kind of sitting in the center, I have this um, medium piece from my hat brand um, pouch set in here. I have tons of different snacks. Then all the way down there at the bottom, I have my um, large set piece from Jujubee. This is keeping all of my diapers and my wipes, my wet bag, and then also my baggy dispenser as well. But I just love how nice and roomy this bag is. Everything fits in without a problem. I don't feel like I'm trying to find space for anything, but I also feel like it's not a ginormous bag. It's a really great size. Let's look at some of the internal organization that you get. Back here in the back, you have a long zippered pocket. In here, this is where I am keeping my pens. And then I also have a compact back there as well. That's a pretty um, generous pocket. You can see it goes all the way up to about right here on my wrist. Then in front of that, you have a nice padded section. This is trimmed out in the um, green leather here. And then you can also see there that it does say Outback. I love that. It looks so high end and really nice. So back there in that pocket, I'm keeping a notebook for myself. I also have some um, different wipes back there. And then I have a Dagny Doe over mesh pouch. This is keeping some busy stuff for the kids. So I have some notebooks and then a really fun little colorful pen. And then I also have an Etch-A-Sketch and some little boogie boards, which I will link down below. I also have my 14 inch laptop here and I wanted to show you that that will fit into that back pocket really easily. It is kind of tall. I think it's meant for a 13 inch laptop. You can see it's kind of tall there, but I can't actually get it to um, zipped close. It's just kind of right there at the very top. So a 14 inch laptop will fit really tightly, um, but a 13 inch laptop will fit there no problem. On the sides you have two elasticated pockets. In this one I am keeping a 24 ounce water bottle. My 40 ounce water bottle will actually fit into that pocket as well. It's just harder to get these snaps closed there so my 24 ounce water bottle fits great and the side snaps close but I also wanted to show you it will fit very nicely into the side bottle pocket just for fun let me show you the 40 ounce because this will fit as well and then that is what it will look like not too bad then in this elasticated pocket on this side I actually have two pieces here this is a um, small set piece from Jujubee which is holding a bunch of little um, toy cars and figurines and stuff for my son and then I have a coin purse here and this just has a ton of coins in it let me turn this around so I can show you the front wall of the bag there are two more bigger elasticated pockets. I really love how they have done these pockets. I don't feel like the pockets are so big where things are kind of falling out, but I feel like they are big enough to hold all my items. I don't feel like they're too snug. I can fit things in there really easily. In this one, I am keeping a um, medium set piece from Jujubee, and in here this is all of my mommy stuff and med stuff. Just random little loose things that I want to keep with me like band-aids and lip gloss. Um, I even have like hair stuff in here. Then in this front pocket right here, I am keeping another um, piece from my hat brand set and in here this is where I have all those mini squigs that are perfect for keeping your kids entertained and busy so there you go another look at the interior I know it's kind of hard to tell because it is a darker bag but I promise in person it's much easier to see and I love that they have this back section trimmed out in the green it just adds a really nice touch to the interior okay so after getting this bag and trying it out I absolutely love love this leather. Most leather bags are kind of heavier. This does not feel heavy. This feels nice and lightweight, but you can see there the leather feels like nice and soft and squishy. All around, this is a pretty awesome bag and I definitely want to get some more bags from this company because I think their products are great and their prices are amazing. I was actually checking out their website. They're actually buy one, get one 50% off right now, which is a crazy deal for the quality of this leather.
leather bag. I reached out to the company and they let me know that the bags are created in India. And it also says on their website that the bag is made with recyclable materials, which is super cool. If you have any questions about this bag, let me know in the comments below. I'm planning to grab a couple other bags from them as well. So if you see any on their website that you are interested in, let me know so that I know which ones to get to review for you all. Thanks for taking time to check out this bag with me and I will see you guys in my next review. Bye.